Before this video starts, I do just want to say thank you to our Patreon members. I'm going to go ahead and name them out real quick. Josh, Seth, Zerlak, Eric, Ty, Cruz, Zachary, Jasper, Matthew, Blank, D, John, and Buck Guy. And most importantly, thank you, MS Blank, the moderator, moderator of the channel, for dropping $100 per month donations on the Patreon. So, link of the Patreon is in the description down below If in case you guys want to join, help support the channel, get some videos early. You can find out all the benefits on the link in the description. Thank you guys to all the patrons, and I'll see you guys in the video. I know I told you guys we were about to get in the video. Sorry about that. Just doing this in editing. I'm also trying a different editing style just for the last series, uh, the last Dynasty series. Uh, like not No music, not so much editing, just kind of like you're watching a live stream or watching the game live on TV. Uh, maybe next episode we'll try to incorporate game sounds from the actual game itself. But uh, just trying this one out for once. Let me know in the comments what you guys think. Obviously, this is just a test. This is not 100% what it's going to look like in the future, but please just let me know. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Trash Room Football. Today is the next episode of the Last Dynasty series. The Last Dynasty that we're going to do right here on the Trash Room Football channel in NCAA 14 revamp today we are still obviously with the app state mountaineers still season one we are eight and one i think our only loss was to georgia state if we look at that real quick yes it was georgia state and we got absolutely molly whomped in that one a lot of our games have been pretty close this season we still got three games to run out the rest of the year so ladies and gentlemen today will be against marshall the thundering herd so without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Jones C. Edwards Stadium, where we're getting ready for the matchup between the number 16 ranked App State Mountaineers and the unranked Marshall Thundering Herd. We are here at Marshall. This will definitely be a very interesting game right here. Uh, I'm going to choose heads. So I have decided I'm going to be a little bit more loose on the last Dynasty series. I feel like I've been trying to be too professional so instead of doing like a lot of commentary stuff, I'm just going to sit back and play. Obviously, I'll talk. It's just, you know, more like this being a live stream. You know, I'm tired of the, oh, he takes the snap, rolls right, oh, and it's incomplete. Now, I'm, I'm kind of tired of that. I, I want you, I think you guys deserve my real reactions and stuff. But yeah, I, I mean, I'm obviously going to say like, yeah, it's second and ten, like it is. But yeah. F or I mean, first and ten, but. And that's just an immediate tackle. I mean, that was easy. That was easy peasy lemon squeezy. Second and 14 now. I mean, I kind of feel like I have to do the calls every now and again. It is what it is. Just be a little bit looser. Fancher? Across the middle. Only for four. Caleb McMillan for a four-yard reception. Yeah, Cam Fancher. All right, third and nine. Going to go with a handoff up the middle. And they're only going to get half a yard, it looked like. And that was... That was awful. That was the worst way Marshall could have ended that drive. So they are at a net positive of one yard. So that's just wonderful for Marshall. Here's Page, our very mid punt returner. Tried to get the edge, just got nothing. All right, well, here comes Chase Bryce, the quarterback. You know, obviously earlier in the season, Noel, the running back, who was very good, got hurt. Cameron Peoples is the backup. But Chase Bryce has done a, a decent job as the quarterback for App State and just on the first play of the game. Wanted to go deep. Offensive line crumbles. Not a good look here to start out the game. Man, I really want to go deep to start. Is D Davis has to be open here. Anytime Davis gave David whatever. Well, that was not even on the money. Um, that was supposed to go to triangle. So already not looking so great here. Let's just try and sit in the pocket. See if we can. Wow and the pocket collapse 
three and out. Awful, awful, awful job right there by the offense. Two drives, one yard between the two teams. Dang it, I should have made that more left. Man, I, I, I need to perfect my punts in these games because I can never get a good punt. Like in Madden, yes. Like I can get a good punt because of the way that you see their little, the little stick thing move across the field, where depending on your, the power of your kick, where it's going to go. Wow, easy first down for Marshall. Man, Cam Fancher, two for two, nineteen yards already. Like, like the thing is, is about this is like our offense is just, it's so, what's the word? Um, back and forth. Like, we can't just be good or just be bad. Like, it's n not consistent, is what I'm trying to say. It's, we bounce from good to bad like it's nothing. You know what I mean? And, um, same goes for the defense. Like, we have the number one ranked defense in the country, yards-wise. And then it just ends up sometimes, I mean, like the Georgia State game. I mean, we got 30-something points dropped on us. And then there's some games where we have scored 30. We only scored 13 against Georgia State. I mean, I obviously don't have hopes of us making the four-team playoff in year one. But, ooh, what a tackle, by the way. But maybe in season two, we could make the 12-team playoff. I do plan on maybe moving App State to the ACC in year two. I feel like that's, uh, I, th I think that's a good idea. Do from con do some conference realignment and page. Again, not a great punt return. We need a different punt returner in year two. But I mean, eight and one is not bad. Eight and one is not a bad record to start out with. I mean, eight and one. Did I say eight and two? I meant eight and one. Cameron Peoples, yeah, just, I mean,. Not the best backup running back. I just, I wish that we could just have Chase Bryce just ball out and at least have a great running back because, I mean, I mean, Nate Knoll, yes, he's hurt, but like, dude, Wells, catch the ball. Dude, Chase Bryce is 0 for 4 already, bro. This is this is not looking good. This is not looking good already, bro. At least it's only zero to zero. Can we get Davis here? Yes, we can, but he's gonna be short. Ugh! Come on. I'm going for it. I I I have to. I I. We need to go balls to the walls in this game if we want to win, man. We need to also change our playbook in year two to a spread i'm tired of what is this or at least change it to the one back maybe run up the middle there you go cameron peoples get you some eight some eight yards he ate that up i'm sorry that was awful it seems we're doing our best when we are running the ball and davis has broken his finger so that's just wonderful out to Gibbs, breaks a tackle, shoves a man off of him, and gets about eight. Dang. He just absolutely just ripped him off of him. Yeah, we're going to have to put in Strowman, who is still a pretty pretty good wideout. Second and two now. Get to see what we can get done here with Chase Bryce. Got the man in motion. And we lost four. I was so focused on that route, I didn't look at a single other one. Dang. Third and five now. 0 for 3 on third downs. Can we do it right here? There we go out to Wells for the first down. Not bad, Christian Wells. Not bad at all. Four for eight, 18 yards is crazy. That's not good. This is going to be a crazy hard game. Um, over the middle to a wide open page. 
I don't understand why they slow down after they catch it so much. And that's going to be the end of the first quarter. Tie game at 0-0. Um, let's see if we can possibly just get a run. Oh, nope, okay. This is not a run, but a play-action pass makes sense. Oh, if he didn't throw off his back foot, he, that, that would have been good. That would have been really good. Um, I don't know if I want to go another play action here. I do have to do just ask the coach for plays because I am an awful play caller. Like maybe defense sometimes I can get it good, but offense, no. I'd rather just let the computer ask me. Strowman, you gotta catch that! Dude, that was an easy touchdown. You gotta catch that, man. I am not going to have to sit here and take three. Oh, come on. Into the end zone. Strowman! I was just raving on you for being a very good wideout, and you dropped two touchdown passes in a row. Two in a row. That's embarrassing. That was very bad. At least we have the lead. Our defense looks decent. Just as long as we don't allow points from this Marshall team, we should be fine. But now with Marshall getting the ball, you know, this is their third drive. I'm gonna go with a handoff. Oh my gosh, bro. Dude, he broke almost all of those tackles until right when he got out of bounds. Our team sells, and it makes me nervous. And then we start being good, and then we start selling again, and then it makes me nervous again. Oh my gosh, man. Another rushing first. This is embarrassing already. This... <laughs> This is... I've never seen my defense look so un... discombobulated, I guess. See what I mean? Like, that should have been a very easy loss of yards right there for the defense. I mean, I guess I've seen our team look more discombobulated. The game against Georgia State, we just looked awful. Yeah, that's not gonna work. Didn't think so. Third and three now. Cam Fancher's 5 for 5, 26 yards. All right, third and three. Come on, defense. Yes! Dingle Prince with the sack. That's what we needed. That is what we needed. Punt return from Page. I'm going to predict seven yards because our punt return team is bad. Oh, and it's going to fake. It's going to be no return yards. He's going to go. Oh, my God. They freaking. They didn't get it. They were short. Half a yard on the fake punt. Half a yard short. Man, that was crazy. Good job, defense, getting that stop on special teams. That's crazy good. Out to Pearson. Bro, oh, my God. Oh, I tried to get out of that, but oh my god, Henry Pearson, we need to see that again. Out to Pearson to the right, catches the ball, boom, get off me. Oh my god, that was crazy. I love seeing stuff from my wide receivers like that. Too bad they're so slow. Just too bad they're so slow. I'm going to make Stroman go on more like a slant. There you go, Strowman, finally catching the ball. Yeah, Strowman had a bad game up until that point. The loss of four, and then two drops in the end zone. Let's see if we hit Davis right here, maybe. Yep, that's going to be first. For a gain of six to Sean Davis, not bad. Come on, we're inching closer. 
let's try and just let's go with the read option i know chase bryce isn't the fastest but at least we can get some yards on the ground with the quarterback I tried. I tried to truck over him. It didn't work. I was going to slide, but I wanted to hit the end zone. Let's run the ball again. Because I, I can't trust throwing that. I can't. I can't. Either I'm going to get Malcolm Butlered, or I'm going to have to go for a field goal again. And Cameron Peoples gets in for the touchdown. Whew. Two possession lead now. Here in the second quarter now. This is good. This is really good. All right. Hughes with the kick out to Keaton. Going to knee it in the end zone. All right. Let's see what we can get done here on defense can we get the ball back and maybe score once more incomplete that was his first incomplete pass only 26 yards over the air at least from the quarterback not the punter but man that would have been a very good fake punt if they had actually gotten that extra half a yard and a sack third and 15 I'm gonna call a timeout here because I want the ball. There's still 92 seconds on the board. Fancher going to drop back. Sacked again. Call our second timeout. Let's get the ball. Maybe run down the field a little bit. Get a, get a three. And move into overtime. Good drive. Great. Great drive from the defense. Page. <laughs> hey, he got the seven like I predicted. <laughs> All right, let's just run the ball here. Ooh, let's go with a jet sweep. I haven't hit much jet sweeps this entire season. Will it work? No, but at least it centers field. This is going to be a long field goal. I know I wanted to run it, but screw it. Why not? Out to Stroman midfield, and it's caught. Maybe we can get a touchdown here. I mean, we can get ballsy here, but I don't know. Oh, <laughs> that DB slapped that down fast. Holy cow. That actually startled me. Man, I don't like these play calls. Uh, you, know, you know what? I'm going my own right here. Wow. Yeah, I do need to change the playbook. These are not great. You can go mesh post. 42 seconds left. Going to try and get it out to Robinson. Maybe Horn on a slant. Horn gets it. I'm going to run the ball here. Because, um... If I get the first, then I can always call it uh, the no huddle. Yep, it got the first. We can get seven here. I think we are going to. Easy walk in. Untouched Cameron Peoples. Man. <laughs> this is a good game for the offense, at least. The first drive looked awful. The second drive didn't look great. But the third and the fourth looked pretty decent. We didn't even have to use that last timeout either. 
and still left second uh, seven, uh 16 seconds on the board i could <laughs> i was almost wanting to say 17 and seconds but it was actually 16 so i had two aneurysms at the same time and they're gonna go with a handoff mm, about three that should take us to halftime Not a bad first half. 17 to nothing is really good. That's really, really good. It's in the game. <laughs> Nissan innovation that excites. Screw that. No halftime show, please. Wow, we're actually going to get a kick return now instead of a punt return. Tucker, and he just, he did an awful job blocking. If he just held his block, I would have gotten, like, that was a weird camera angle. That freaked me out. We would have gotten a good return. But we're going to have to go from the 15. Let's go deep again. Um, If we can find anyone deep. One-on-one -on -one ball. Screw it. Horn dropped it! Oh, he had it. Oh, come on. We should not be struggling over the air with freaking Marshall, bro. Out to Pearson. Easy first. The tight end. Good play. Two receptions, 62 yards. That's awesome. 11 for 20, 146. At least we haven't thrown a pick this game. So at least we that have that to hang our hat on. Pearson, he almost caught that too. I knew if he came back for it, he could have caught it, but he dropped it. There's been so many passes dropped. Like I can't, I can't help that. I can't help if I switch over to player over to the player and still press triangle. Oh, I threw that one too. Did he catch that? He freaking caught that. David Larkins? That was an insane catch. Wow. Okay. Go with a handoff. Ooh, nothing. See why Cameron Peoples is not good? It's probably also because he's slow and our offensive line is booty. So, and not booty in the good sense. You guys know what I mean by booty in the good sense. This is not booty in the good sense. This is like awful booty, like in the bad sense. Oh my God. Bryce has just been inaccurate this game. Like he's gotten some throws, but it's either been dropped or just way off the money. Come on. See what I mean? Like that's not my fault. If I'm throwing to an open man, that's not my fault. How far would this field goal be? 59 yards. No thanks. I'm going for it. There's no reason for us not to. Strowman! That was your third drop of the game! Two of them would have been a touchdown. One of them would have been a first down. Oh my god. Dude, Strowman, you you're bad today. He's been good. Not today. Oh man. This is this is <laughs> Yeah, offenses look pretty bad. Thankfully, our defense is semi-decent. Because if our defense sucked, or if we were playing against a really good offense, we would be losing. Because this team has had many, many drive chances to score. And we've only gotten two touchdowns and a field goal. That should have been a pick. That should have been a pick. But it wasn't, but it should have been.
Yeah, look at that. Only 53 yards of offense from Marshall. Page almost messed that up. Oh my god, Page finally with a good punt return of 30 yards. I think that, I think that's his highest of the entire season. Can we just run the ball now? Like that would be great. Oh my god. You know, I don't like screens. But let's do one, because why not? Out to Pearson, and it kind of worked. It actually kind of worked. I always never do screens because it never works for me. Come on, third and one now. Oh my god, peoples! He shoved them off of him like he was crazy. We're still looking decent. So I guess that's the best that we can say. Out to Pearson again. Dude, Pearson's had a wonderful game. Four receptions, 86 yards. Pearson looks good. He's not on here anymore. Dang it. It is what it is. Oh, no, it didn't go over his head like I intended it to. Well, it can't be an App State last Dynasty game without an interception. I think we've thrown an interception in every single game this season. Yes, even the game against the FCS team, which was probably the game we struggled the most and won in. If Marshall comes back and wins this, because it's still possible. If the AI just decided, like, let's just let Marshall just come back and make this game as hard as possible for Trasher, I wouldn't be surprised. Because that's some BS thing the EA would make, wouldn't it? Oh my god! Oh my god! Bro, he got smacked! That was one of the craziest tackles I've seen in a long time on this series. Come on, snap the ball. Are you scared of my defense now, Fancher? Well, doesn't look like it because they got an easy first and then some. A gain of 23. Well, at least we put the fear of God into their quarterback. So he knows not to go with the options anymore. First and ten, man in motion. Pitch to the right. It's not going to go anywhere. All right, now second and twelve. Going to go with the handoff to the right, and it's not going to go anywhere either but backwards. Third and sixteen now. They are 0 for 5 on third down. 0 for 5. Let's see what they can do here. Saw Dublin coming up. And that's only going to get 6. Corey Gamage? Is that like Gamma Damage? Is that like when you accidentally step too far in Chernobyl? Well, that's the end of the third quarter now. And they're going to go for it, which doesn't surprise me. Fourth and ten, which this feels like a long fourth and ten. And no, that's that's not going to work right here. Ten for 13, 74 yards. He's been accurate, but 
not for many yards. We've seemed to stop it pretty easily. A flea flicker? How is this going to work? <laughs> it, it didn't. It did not. Man, now we're just trying stuff. We're just pulling some of the crazy plays out of the playbook that we haven't tried so far. Wells held on to it. That was a good catch. Five for 15 for 30, 201, one pick. Davis! Deshaun Davis looked good on that right there. Man. All right. We need a passing touchdown. To outdo our pick, we need a passing touchdown. Thankfully, Strowman is not on the field to drop it. And apparently Strowman had Horn's uniform on because Horn dropped a very easy touchdown pass in the end zone. All right, come on. And that was tipped. He didn't even try to go up for it. Third and goal now. Come on, we need a passing touchdown. To outdo the freaking pick. Ah, uh, freaking finally! And it was Strowman this time! He put his jersey back on and finally decided to start playing good. There we go. We extend the lead 24 0. And the score is does not represent. It does not. You would look at this score post game and be like, oh, wow, App State whooped them. I mean, yeah, if Marshall's offense wasn't so bad, it wouldn't be. Because their defense doesn't even look that great either. First and 10. Fancher. And he gets sacked again. How many times have we sacked Fancher today? Or tackled him for a loss? Gonna go with a handoff. Oh, he pushed him right off of him. Gain of six makes it third and 11. All right, takes the snap, throws over the middle. Ah, come on. Come on, man. That's not so good. Not so good. All right, come on. Second and six. Okay, but how did he break those two tackles? He slipped out of it like he was a snake covered in butter. Fourth and one now. Okay. All right. Second or fourth and one. I meant like two minutes, 10 seconds. Almost said second and 10. And they're just going to let the clock wind down. Oh, no, they're not. Going to run it up to the left. Not going to get it. Didn't work again. Didn't work before. And I think it's time to start running the clock out here. With good old Cameron Peoples, the backup running back. Didn't get anywhere, though. Um, Yeah, we need to go to coaching adjustments. 
There we go. Just start letting the clock run out so we can go home. Wash our jock straps. Oh, Cameron Peoples with a good run. Not bad, Peoples. Not bad. One more run, and then a knee, and that should do it. Only two. Okay. All right, where's the knee? Take this game home. Victory formation for the Mountaineers. And App State comes in and shuts out the Thundering Herd. In a very good game. Well, entertaining, but not good. Like, there's still a lot of stuff I was very disappointed in. But um, it didn't. It didn't look great. You know, this could have been very bad. Very, very bad. All right, let's look at some stats right here. Chase Bryce was 17 for 34, 240, a touchdown and a pick. Peoples was 11 rushes for 50 yards, two touchdowns. The best receiver was Pearson. Yeah, look at that. Drop. Two drops, drop, another two drops. I mean, that's six passes that were dropped that could have had... Uh... Yeah, that would he would have been 23 for 34, which wouldn't have been awful. But to look at uh, Fancher, yeah, 13 for 16, 95 yards. Ethan Payne, uh, oh my god, look at Fancher! Five attempts, negative 31 rushing yards. So they had a total of one rushing yard the entire game. I mean, look at that. Like, if we go over to team stats, yes. <laughs> one rushing yard. <laughs> That's crazy, man. That is absolutely crazy. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let me know what you guys think of the comments of this being like a not so like edited video, kind of like you're sitting in front of a real game simulation type thing. I know these would be longer, but it, ta it takes a long time to edit like the silence and stuff out and uh, get the music right, you know, all of that. So let me know what you guys think just without the music, just straight up normal game, not so much editing. Um, and let me know how, how it's like with the chilled back trasher for this. Um, I, I want to hear what you guys think. Cause that's, this is something that I've been wanting to do for a while with the last dynasty series. So I'm, I don't feel like I'm tense the entire episode, but we did move up to number 15. Um, we do face Georgia Southern real quick. Let's look at the, uh, bowl projection, see who we're faced. Um, the New Orleans Bowl against UTEP is who we're predicted to face off against. Um, just to look at the big ones. Yeah, we'll, we'll do, um, a hundred percent sim, like the four team playoff right now. It's looking like Georgia, Oklahoma, Colorado, Florida state, which is not bad, but I just, I just want to show you guys how awful the quarterback play has been. 110 for 202. 1,810 yards, 9 touchdowns, 15 picks. Not great. Uh, Cameron Peoples has also not looked that great. You know, I mean, Nate Knoll, Nate Knoll looked decent, but he broke his collarbone. Uh, and, of course, Ryan Berger's the backup quarterback. But, like, Cameron Peoples, I mean, 87 rushes, 346 yards, 10 touchdowns. His longest rush is only 15 yards. His longest rush. Only 43 yards per game. I mean, and only one broken tackle. Like, that's awful. But let me know in the comments what do you guys think about kind of the laid-back episodes, not so much editing. Uh, hope you guys all have a wonderful day, and I'll see you guys later.